if x minus 1 over x is equal to 3, find the value of x squared plus 1 over x squared. Now this is again continuing with perfect square formula. Okay. So what is given is x minus 1 over x is equal to 3. And I want to find x squared plus 1 over x squared. I'm going to square both sides. So this is x minus 1 over x. The whole squared is equal to 3 the whole squared. So <coughs> expanding this using perfect square formula. So this is x squared minus 2 times x times 1 over x plus 1 over x the whole squared is equal to 9. So this simplifies to x squared. Now this and this gets cancelled. So this is minus 2 plus 1 over x squared is equal to 9. So I can write this as x squared plus 1 over x squared minus 2 is equal to 9. This implies if you add 2 to both sides, you can write x squared plus 1 over x squared is equal to 11. So if x plus 1 over x is uh, 3, x squared plus 1 over x squared is 11. Okay, so let us look at one more question. If x plus 1 over x is 5, find the value of x squared plus 1 over x squared. Again, x squared plus 1 over x squared and x cubed plus 1 over x cubed. So let us start with, let us use a different color now. So this is x plus 1 over x is equal to 5. So I'm same way I'm going to expand uh, square both sides. So this implies 1x plus 1 over x, the whole squared is equal to 5 the whole squared. So this implies this is x squared plus 2 times x times 1 over x plus 1 over x, the whole squared is equal to 25. So this simplifies to x squared plus 2 plus 1 over x squared is equal to 25. So let me rewrite. So this is x squared plus 1 over x squared, only rearranging, plus 2 is equal to 25. So if you take away 2 from both sides, I can say x squared plus 1 over x squared is equal to 23. Okay, so now we have got x cubed plus 1 over x cubed. Now, before doing that, uh, you have to know one formula. The formula is like this. a cubed plus b cubed. You can prove this yourself. Is a plus b times a squared minus ab plus b squared. Now, this is a formula. This is a very useful formula. Uh, if you're interested, you expand the expand the right hand side, you will get this. So using this formula, can I say x cubed plus 1 over x cubed is equal to, so you compare x with a and 1 over x with b. So this is nothing but x plus 1 over x times x squared will become uh, a squared would become x squared minus a times b. Your a is x and your b is 1 over x. So this is x times 1 over x plus b squared is 1 over x squared. So this simplifying this, this is nothing but x plus 1 over x times x squared plus 1 over x squared. And this is nothing but negative 1 or minus 1. Now, what is x plus 1 over x? x plus 1 over x is 5. So, in place of x plus 1 over x, in place of x plus 1 over x, I can put 5. And in place of x squared plus 1 over x squared, I can put 23. So, this is equal to 5 times 23 minus 1, which is nothing but 5 times 22. So this is 5 times, so 5 times 20 is 100. 
and 5 times 2 is 10. So this is 110. 